Hi, I'm Lauren. Welcome to Space Rocks. We have had an action-packed morning here at SDEX ESA Open Day. You can talk to people who work for ESA, engineers, project managers and scientists. When I heard Alan Shepard launch into space when I was 12 years old, I decided at that moment that's what I wanted to do someday. Stephen, good morning. Good morning. Nice to see you again. I'm so excited to be here. This is uh, incredible. Wow. So you know, I really want to show you some wow. of the facilities. I can't wait. So let's go. Let's, let's go. go. Yeah. It's so important to us to have these kind of open days of to share what we do with the public. We're expecting about 10,000 people through today. That's amazing. I'm just loving what I see. If you just look around here, all these people, smiles in their faces, uh, big wide open eyes, uh, it's, it's amazing. And this is what space is about. It's really working as a team. So if they ever need to send like a small physicist into space, <laughs> I'm really... <laughs> We want to showcase um, how many fantastic technologies are developed here, how many fantastic space missions are developed here. It looks like a really intense recording studio. Exactly, yeah, yeah. We have managed to secure quite the interview. This is Mickey, the space cat. What are the details of what's going on behind those doors? When developing a satellite, before sending to space, you have to make sure that it's working. This is one of the shaker tables. It can do the equivalent of a magnitude seven earthquake. You're kidding me. To 23 tons strapped on top. Wow. It is a spacecraft torture chamber. It's not all been about rocket science. We've also given a Space Rocks Inspiration Award to Stephen Strait and the team at The Expanse. We had a fantastic week with a lot of astronauts uh, here at Aztec. It's always a pleasure to explain and see the people, how impressed they are by the facility that we have. What you see here is the sunspots. That's what Galileo and Kepler could observe already 400 years ago. Many of the kids will later look at the t-shirt they got today or some things that they created with their own hands and say that was the beginning of my space career. I'm looking forward to be able to show to everyone that the space sector is closer to them than they think. People are beginning to develop this belief that space really is for everyone. I was doing the two things I love most, being a mom and being an astronaut. I love what I do. Finally, just one more question. Are you aware you're a cat?